Hello everyone, Sam is here and in today's lesson we're gonna go through customizing your website and adding your product. So after you log in, go to theme and in here click on customize. I just did like a very basic thing, you're gonna find the pretty much like empty kind of like this uh, in the first very first picture here you just I just like upload the picture or you can just put any any picture you like uh, that is like a free stock they offer you here and you can pick like your niche you know and you can pick picture from here or you can pick a picture from uh, your uh, um from your manufacturer or from your product page or whatever you like so this is the picture i picked and uh and on the same section the first one down here you're gonna find uh pretty much like some uh, editing you leave it all the same only the text i just put here for example you will have a peace of mind uh with this product uh, this stop the spy camera detector will allow you to rest a sort of no uh, an approved camera or transmission uh, as you change here like the big title and here is uh, the small description in here as you change it you're gonna see like it's kind of live uh, you can see like in after the mind right now i'm just messing around there you go it shows so it's pretty much uh, simple and easy uh, you're gonna go to the second one here you can add like some title image some description blog whatever you like and uh, let me see this one here uh, I'm gonna actually uh, remove it so I just click on uh, uh, remove this section and this one I'm keeping this one here and remove this one as well if you're doing one product store we need to make it as simple as possible all right okay so you can uh, in the same time like you can add a section add anything like you can pick from here collection list uh, featured product gallery image with text you know you, you have like a lot of options for example let's say i'm gonna add this a uh, logo list right here in this logo list um, I'm gonna select image I upload like for example this one here all right select I'll go to the next one select I'll pick a different logo here and the next one select I pick into one and those you get them like from uh google or from your uh supplier you know it's not like a, a big deal all right i add like this four uh, i can add more as you can see i can put five but no need uh remove section uh, I removed like all the section. I'm gonna do it again. And there we go. Uh, pretty much done in this section. Always as you do any step in here, click save. Right? Um, let's see what we have here. We have right now uh, this logo list actually. Don't keep uh, the title here. As it says logo list i'm gonna just remove it all right this uh, looks better or you can add like something to it. uh i'm gonna just organize it a little bit uh testimonial i'm gonna put it uh up mm, yeah right here is good and uh the logo list i'm gonna put it before the last picture or just uh, before the testimonial there you go looks good yeah there, that's pretty much what you need uh right now we're gonna add like some uh 
we're gonna add like some button you go to the first page here it says button label in here I'm gonna name it shop and I, I would like you to do the same thing here the link we're gonna make the shop is uh, the products you have right all products that's it save exit I would like to do the same exact thing in uh, the in the last picture you have here uh, button I call it shop now for example shop now and product products all the products all right uh that's pretty much it so what we did we did this image some titles same thing here you can put like image and description or to image or whatever you want i did like some description here you know and i did this logo looks cool testimonial uh you just write some testimonial in the page let me go ahead and uh show you uh it's the same easy step you go write something and write the name I'm gonna show here and what you write is gonna be here that's pretty much it you do three different ones uh you can copy them from like uh, your uh, the, the reviews on your uh, supplier product or from Amazon or you write them down do whatever the heck you want so um, we have pretty much uh, done this is like the pages I have we did we done like uh, the last time this is like uh, uh, contact us privacy policy and the rest of the pages pretty much down here search uh, privacy policy or fund policy term of service and contact us no, I'm gonna go um, this one contact always keep it on the right side so I'm gonna go to the navigation in here and then we go to the main menu and we just switch it from before the last to the last one right oops I messed up here we go there we go right now save and boom right now it's gonna update as uh, the last one contact us if we refresh the page here we're gonna see it changed to the last one here uh this one on the header section here it's uh, a logo you pretty much like you do your own logo i use, i personally use uh, um, photoshop to do logos if you you don't know like and you, you don't have any experience or you don't know how to do it, it's very easy on uh, fiverr you can just uh, hire someone to do it for just five dollar you just go to fiverr.com which it's uh, f i b e rr.com and you find a lot of uh, people who does logo for just five bucks send you a few, few examples and you pick one for yourself and you use it you, you you use it here if you don't have a logo you're gonna see the store name that you named uh, in here right so that's pretty much uh, what we have done uh, after you do everything like picture make sure like you get a higher resolution if you're not taking it from like the store uh the free uh picture they have in here free images you know they have like a high quality picture stuff so if you're not getting it from here make sure you get something high quality you know don't get like something blurry or looks weird you know we don't want that we want our website to be as professional as we can and as simple as we can remember this is like where the customer gonna feel comfortable this is something give him decision even to buy feel comfortable trust your site or looks like oh this company looks like crap and they pretty much like leave or buy your product from uh, somewhere else so make sure everything looks perfect in here we're gonna go uh, through uh, editing some of the uh, titles here as you can see it's so basic we're gonna just do a little bit of uh, 
uh, editing we go to the theme setting in here typograph as we can see here we can click change and pick some titles um, something like more simple I guess or like a little bit of difference you know let me see here what looks good for me you don't want something like weird you know we want it simple and looks good as well right uh this one now uh no I like this one, it's not bad. Let me see if I can like something else. No. And. No. This, this one looks cool, it's simple, it's not that bad. I'm gonna go with this one, I guess. Alright, I'm gonna click. Make sure, like, it's better than uh, better than before, you know, and it's just, like, simple. Here we can mess around a little bit with uh, the heading base size. Let's see. Mm, this is not good. I think I keep it at... Uh, 24, 24, let's uh, piece of mind, 25, yeah, I like 25 is good. All right, uh, we're going to see the body text in here, and we're going to change the body, let's see, this is something like body text, um, let's see, something not weird, we just need something simple and looks cool as well that's all what we need this is uh this is cool boom boom it's a little bit small but it looks like really cool i like it we can uh, make it a little bigger let's see 16 how it looks I like it at 15. Yeah, it looks cool to me at 15. All right, and uh, right now we're pretty much like done customizing the main page. Uh, we're gonna go and get a product for your site. So as we go to products, we find everything is empty here. So we're gonna just like forget about everything make sure you click save after the saving we're gonna go to um, apps and then visit the Shopify app store after you click that you're gonna write Dropify and you're gonna find this uh, logo in here Dropified and you're gonna find like this green logo right here Dropify dropshipping you're gonna install this is one of my favorite app uh, it gives you like 14 uh, days free trial so you can install it see how things work and then you can change it to something else or you, li or you like it it's up to you so after you install this app and you put pretty much your information it's easy to install you just click on it add app and that's pretty much it you put some information and boom you're done so um let's exit uh, this page and go to our apps uh you're gonna find it like in get started here you're gonna pretty much install the extension 
and then it says like go to aliexpress ebay blah blah, blah. we're gonna go go to aliexpress find our product after we find our product we're gonna click on this green logo here by the way this app like extension is really helpful so i wrote like my product's name here and it shows me like uh, the the prices has impact how much or impact free you know as you see here it gives me like a lot of information uh easy to use you can add it from here or you can after click and opens in a new page you can click on the same green logo usually shows on uh, this side this side in here there you go we click on this one save product we're gonna find our product in product saved right here there you go this is uh the product saved already we uh click on it and right here is the magic happens you know right here we're gonna work on uh description of the product editing uh, deleting some picture changing the prices a lot of things uh we're gonna work on here please this is very 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 important that you edit the description never ever you keep the aliexpress description and most of them just like shows you a weird stuff like specification and boom that's it that's a description if you do that you will not get sales and you will fail down all right you will just like waste your money and lose it please this is very important to make your own description or at least you know i don't advise you to do this but you can do it you can take some ideas from the description of like uh, of your uh, uh, supplier or you can write your product's name on amazon right amazon and then write your product's name for example here uh, my product is a spy camera detector or something like that there you go the product showed up I'm gonna click on it and then I'm gonna check up the description they have. They have here the f for like pretty much like the most five uh, important like points, you know. And they have a description all the way down in here, you know. This is a very a way better description to use more than just like AliExpress because people in in there they don't like really spend any time. Um, building or doing a very nice description if you're not a very good writer i recommend you use some stuff you can copy half of this and you check another like uh seller you know and copy other half from him or you came up with something between them you know you figured it out and um i just say like i don't like recommend this because because uh it's like about like copyright things you know issues but I rather you do this than you use AliExpress product. You know, I really want you to succeed in this business. So please listen carefully to what I said and what I recommend because I'm giving you like five years of experience. You know, I really like from the zero failure, failure, failing, failing, failing knowing what's wrong you know uh, seeing other people uh, like all of this came like from experience you know your website is very important to be simple to be professional to look like comfortable to buy from and your product description and title is really important so we have some work to do in here which the description and we're gonna see like usually like don't use uh, this one here you can click remove if you have it you know uh, I usually uh, remove this one it's cool but you see it says like color it's like at least change it to blog type for example blog type you know or depends or like type only it's it depends on the product you, you're selling you know uh, the price here we can change it here or we can change it in um, in our uh, um, product uh, uh, page in Shopify so it doesn't matter here for example I'm gonna change the price let's say 
you know, uh, here the weight and stuff, it's not that important if you're offering like free shipping and which you should do. Some product you should like pay, let them pay for the shipping, but try to make it a fixed uh, rate. We're gonna go later like to show you how to edit uh, the shipping uh, cost and uh, for United States, uh, Canada and the rest of the world, how you can do it uh, easy. So uh, you work on a nice description after you're done everything you pick like a picture by the way this is the, this app i like it because it's really helpful like it makes me uh, they charge you monthly okay but they i don't lose much time you know instead of for example downloading if this picture because many products they have like the company logo on it and you don't want to use that because it's like you you are the company for your customer you know they, you don't want like your shop name apple and you're selling samsung logo picture with a samsung in it you know so if it has a logo you can just go here it has option to edit or uh, uh, to move background you know simple editing and have even advanced uh, editor you can edit like and remove like logo or anything you don't like in the pictures and or you remove like the whole picture let me see for example this one here i don't like it so I just uh, I just remove it from. Oops. Delete and there you go. That's uh, how it works. After you're done with uh, your description, you know, and uh, don't play a lot with this. All right, make it simple. Maybe you make it italic and uh, some, for example example the big title in not not the title of the product i mean like the title in the description like this for example okay to make it um bold like this so that's uh, pretty much it don't make it super small or super big keep it average keep everything 16 form blah 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 keep everything pretty much uh, the same the only thing you're gonna change this make some picture and in the end like we're gonna see uh, some trust budget that's uh, that's really helpful all right guys uh in here so i just like did some uh description here first uh i just wrote like for example this little unit gives you a peace of mind by being able to make uh a sweep and detect uh, a wipe range uh, of illegal spying blah 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 you know and then i put like this trust budget it's easy to get this type of uh, picture you just get it from uh, google i'm gonna open new page just write trust budget and uh, you go to images trust budgets and you go to images and you find a bunch you can pick like uh something like this you know and uh you paste it or you upload it in uh, the description we have here and uh the mine says hustle free uh return 30 days money back guarantee free worldwide shipping fast processing and then uh some picture and description picture and description i use like some moving uh, picture here a gif uh, it's pretty cool and then um, for example here are some uh, uh, more information about the product uh, and where to use it where I can use this you know it says motel hotel Airbnb meeting rooms blah 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 you know and in the end it says uh, our guarantee it's uh, important to write this um, in the description but um, free shipping no surprise or hidden fee if you're doing free shipping Safe payment via card or uh, PayPal. 30 days money back guarantee. Real human uh, on our 24-7 uh, support help desk. Uh, tracking number for every order and then another trust budget. And in the small, uh, here I wrote, 
We use uh, uh, encrypted SSL uh, certificates for 100% security. People, they're gonna use your their credit card. They don't want like get spam or hacked or anything. So they want to feel comfortable. You know, it's very important to uh, use this here. Uh, please note, due to the high demand, we uh, anticipate delivery of your awesome product within 12, 25 days. Global, quicker US, Canada, Australia, in some cases, our carrier may take longer than the estimate delivery time to deliver our item to you. Additional delays may occur due to weather condition, holiday, etc. On order of two or more items, faster shipping will be provided whenever possible. Just have your customer, don't lie to them, have your customer uh, take an idea about their product gonna it's not like amazon prime so it's not gonna be next day or in two days uh have them idea like it's gonna be in few weeks you know usually usually 12 to 25 days you know some cases it may take longer but usually it's a quicker to us and canada so it depends on how the description of your uh, uh product in aliexpress by the way try to use the product if you like your marketing us canada for example uh which is the biggest market try to use ship from here and spot united states here it's a way faster shipping you may pay a little more but it's a way faster shipping so you don't have like chargeback you don't have problems with your customer and a lot of emails and you need to reply and you're starting by yourself you don't you didn't hire anyone for customer service yet so it's uh, pretty important like uh try to use something from uh, the US market. And uh, pick something with the impact because it's a faster shipping than just like a regular one or without even uh, some some shipping uh, without even tracking number, you know, just like, oh, okay, it's shipped what it is, but without tracking number because you didn't want to pay a little bit more. You need to pay a little extra dollar to dollar, whatever it is, but you don't have a lot of problem with your customers anyway so uh, this is pretty much it after you done all uh, uh, the stuff you need you can just uh, click uh, make a product visible send to my store right and after this we're gonna find the product in our store ready to use <laughs> all right it says shopify export product exported let's go to our shopify here uh, let's leave this uh, page go to products all products and boom there you go this is our product if you forget to edit something you know you can just edit it no never use like this long title just make it simple you know no so like stop spy for example uh stop stop the spy hidden camera detector that's it make it as simple as possible uh i click save so the new title is saved there you go changed and right now as you can see we can edit more if you want edit like some picture adds picture remove you know whatever you want here uh i have like um some uh, uh options the type for example and the price i can change it uh, more you know i'm gonna for example click this too and uh, edit prices okay here for example let me change this one for 79.97 it's the same thing just different log 79.97 done right now the price is changed to uh 79.97 make sure always click save so we don't forget if uh, anything goes uh, wrong with your computer or something or you just exit the page and boom uh you forget what what you did uh i i usually like open in bulk as seen here and change the compare price for example 159.97 make something like make something um 
like reasonable. Don't, uh, for example, iPhone case is selling it, for example, for $20, and then you put in compare pr price is uh, $200. Doesn't make sense. All right? So something reasonable that it is on sale. This is uh, the actual price, and we're selling it for this price. People like to take advantage of sales. So we make sure we use this. All right? Uh, let's go see how things going. Uh, go to theme, customize. And let's see how our product page looks like. We're gonna click on shop even here or here. We already done that. As we can see, this is how it looked like. It says sale from 159.97 to 79.97. This is the um, the title, the description, everything looks cool, you know. One important tip in here. One very important tip is. Um, you click on this side here uh, this is like the phone version you want to make sure wherever picture you have whatever uh, things you have it's convenient for phone version because this is where the most sales come from this is most of people they buy using their phone barely like some 10% of people using their computer so this is more important than the big computer uh how it how it look like you know you go to phone page make sure it looks very convenient uh looks cool nothing like looks weird or out of the range you know if there is anything wrong you just fix it right so uh yeah it looks good here the uh, we have the title we have the options here they're gonna see it like this on the phone version you know and the picture uh as well right now we made sure like everything is good i pretty much i didn't like the title that much so i'm gonna change it uh, i'm gonna go to theme setting and here i'm gonna change the title uh font let's pick something else you know, I don't know why I didn't like it. This one looks better, you know. Just uh, try to make it, this looks weird. Try to make it, uh, so yeah, I, for some reason I like this one. You know, it looks simple. Uh, I'm gonna go with this one uh, for the moment. I'm gonna select and save. All right, and uh, let me see the description, looks cool. I'm gonna go to uh, let's see here we have colors uh, also you can change like the cell color uh, this one's here you can change the uh, colors of the background you know let's see what we can do here body text cell price for example uh, uh, let's uh, let's see the cell price what we can do with it mm, uh, the team I'm gonna because I use the blue a lot, I'm gonna use like uh, a blue for for my sale, you know. There you go. And uh, uh, primary button. Oh, this is the buttons too. I'm gonna use something close to blue. There you go. Uh, go. That's perfect. Uh, ta -ta -ta. all right always click save uh, the text I'm gonna keep everything normal uh, border let's keep it this way this way background you can change if you want but don't change to something weird please as simple as possible uh the heading here i may change it a little blue as well uh no no i'm gonna keep it black too much of blue uh heading black right uh let's see the top here we can uh, the selector the header here can add uh, show an announcement here it's uh, pretty cool to use uh, this uh, Future. show an announcement here all right let me write for example uh, uh, free shipping 
chipmunk world white right something simple or we have 50 percent of today's only or something like that uh, i'm gonna click save I'm gonna take off the home page only, so it shows here on the product page free shipping worldwide. Right, and here I can change this one to two. It goes with my uh, team, you know. Yeah, this is matching the logo, matching the buttons, so I think it looks cool. I'm gonna try to make it a little darker. The dark looks nicer, I guess. There you go. And even like you keep this one black, it's completely uh, fine as well. Right? This one too, uh, I'm gonna try to make it darker for some reason. I like it dark. I don't want something like hurt the eyes, you know? Uh, colors, primary buttons, let's go darker. There you go, that's perfect. How uh, exactly I like it. <laughs> uh, that's pretty much it for this uh, lesson. We did pretty much build our website. We're gonna do like a few edits. Um, uh, for example, in this page here, we're gonna do some uh, editing in here. Uh, we're gonna take off this thing here and we're gonna make the shop is just like the, our product directly. Uh, this feature we can use it when we have a complete niche, which means like multi products uh, niche. We have like five, ten products in the same niche of camera system or whatever the product you picked. Uh, it's a good idea to use um, uh, to use this way but right now we're gonna go ahead and change that so we go online store and then we go to uh, navigation we go to main menu and the shop here we're gonna click on edit all product we're gonna x exit that and go products and we pick our product directly apply changes save and right now we're gonna see how it look like so if someone goes home and click on the shop here and boom it takes him directly to this uh product page right so it uh, doesn't go like to all products and then you have to click on that one product you know that's something for someone having a bunch of uh, niche product or general store so uh that's pretty much it. We pretty much done and uh, we built our site. We added the product, everything uh, ready to go. Uh, I hope like did everything as I told you. And then everything simple, everything perfect. Add the trust budget. Uh, you did nice description. It doesn't have to be big, but it has to be something people enjoy to read, you know? uh you did add uh, the uh the budget here we have our uh links the pages we created everything looks cool on the site we're gonna just do some apps that we need uh we're gonna install them uh in the next lesson uh and then we're gonna go through the marketing which the next important part of uh, this business Right, so I'll see you next time.